like I'm not existing anymore. Don't exist. Live your life. Live it to the fullest. I feel like an anime character. Hey YouTube, what's up? It's Kira again. This week, since a lot of people wanted me to de do, I promise I can speak English in complete sentences. I know I can, and I believe in myself. So a lot of people wanted me to do a DIY Princess Kita costume. Keep in mind, this is a very inexpensive, well my version is very inexpensive. It's not like completely extravagant. I kind of did like kind of a basic thing just if you don't have a lot of money, I eat. I made mine $20 and under, and I went to Joanne Fabric to get most of everything and the beauty supply store. So I'm just gonna get right into the video of how I did my costume. What you need for this is a crystal, some suede cording, some stretchy string, and some scissors. So first what you wanna do is take the clear string and cut about two inches and then place it through the hole of the crystal. <laughs> Next you want to do is tie it a couple times. I tied it around eight or seven times just to make sure it's secure. Then what you want to do is take your suede cording and cut it to however long you want the necklace to be. You want to place the suede cording through the hole of the clear string, underneath the knots of the clear string. Then you want to cut the excess and tie it around just like a necklace. Next, I got some ribbon or some fabric. You can choose whatever fabric you want to do. For my cosplay, I felt it would be easiest just to tie it in a knot instead of kind of hooking it. You could also go on Amazon and just get an armband, but this was only $2 and it worked perfectly fine. So for the skirt, I opened up all the material and then wrapped it around my body. Um, I tied it at this kind of angle and then I double tied it just to make sure it's secure and then pulled out the fabric to make the flap. Now you can leave it like this, it's super long, um, but Princess Kita does have a shorter skirt so I decided to make mine a little bit shorter by wrapping it around my body and tucking it in to the front parts of the skirt. And there you have the skirt. And now for the shirt. So I got a little bit thin material, which was a bad idea. So you can see it kind of stretching out. Um, so I would, I would suggest getting a thicker material that is stretchy because mine was like not. <laughs> also, this is the way I tied it for um, my cosplay. I would not recommend unless you have thick material or a scarf because this material is very thin, so it does not have a lot of support. I would just suggest getting more supportive fabric and thicker fabric that will cover everything. Parts I didn't show in the video, just like the blue symbol thing. I just went to the beauty supply store and got some really cheap blue lipstick, um, the kind that normally doesn't ever work on your lips, and I just put it right here. But I was also thinking about getting face paint, um, light blue face paint. And for the hair, I also used the um, suede cording to just wrap the cord around my hair for the little piece that she has right here. That's it. I didn't feel the need to show that because I thought that was pretty simple. Everything else, yeah, but remember, the fabric I used was very thin. It was a little bit stretchy, but it was very thin. I would suggest, and I got three yards of fabric. I would suggest getting a thicker fabric. And if you do have a fabric that is um, much thinner like mine, I would double it. So I would probably get six yards. Again, that's more expensive, but it has more support and more coverage. Like mine completely worked and you couldn't see anything. But in the future, if you are of course, I'm going to start picking in my ear when I'm talking. But in the future, if you are going to use this for Halloween or going out and be out all night or all day, I would use something more supportive. Also, under the skirt, I wore spandex so you don't see all the goodies, you know what I'm saying. And for the top, I got these pasties from Target that I did not wear in the video or in my outfit, but I got them for future, for future, futureness. To wear, to wear if I wanted to wear the costume for Halloween. I hope you liked that video. Give it a thumbs up if you liked it. That is it, you guys. It's Princess Kita. <laughs>
<laughs> just kidding. But 